Event 39 is the next event on the track. This is the under 14 boys, 800 metres. This is a timed final, so we will see two races here of the under 14 boys. VBP for this event is 159.45, set in 2012 by Ryan Patterson. Uh, Kim, this has actually been updated to a uh, final. Oh. Uh, I can see here on Results Hub. So I'll let you call out the lane assignment. I will call out the lane assignments once they get underway. So we will just adjust that graphic there on the bottom left-hand side of your screen. So as you can see, there's quite a few athletes in this race here. So in from lane one, Sloan, two, Jay, three, Ethan, Tainui, Brody, Joel, Peter, Tashil, Charlie, Xavier, James, Jack, Effion, Jake, Joshua, Sebastian. So they are your competitors in this uh, now final for the boys under 14. So obviously an athlete scratched and we were able to combine the two events into one. So that is Farrelly out in front. See from the Mornington uniform. So Sebastian comes in with a seated time of 2.03. So you do expect him to be out the front in the lead at the moment. He's followed by Jake Olorencio from Knox at 2.11 PB. So quite quick, 61 or so there through 400 metres. So Sebastian's in a race out on his own there. Battle is going to be on though for the minor placings. A bit easier for these athletes. They don't need to try and work out what the other time final I think the important thing as well here as well, Lachlan, to mention is that Mornington athlete currently, uh, there's another Mornington athlete here as well. I believe there was one who he came in with a really relatively good seated time, but in the second heat. So this group combining together will obviously be to his advantage as well. But it is Sebastian Farrelly coming around to the final 100 metres of this event. He's been chased down by Jake Olorenshaw and also the South Melbourne District to Shield. So Sebastian's going to take this one out. Unofficial time of 2.06. With Jake Olorenshaw in second. We'll leave third to photo finish between to Shield and also... The Essendon athlete, is there? Uh, yes, so that's Charlie Barrett from Essendon. So we'll leave the photo finish for the bronze medal position to photo finish. So make sure you get a look at our Results Hub site. So one of the great features of Results Hub it is it does update, does uh, speak with the meat manager program. So if the meat manager team, competition director or manager to change any of the races due to uh, DNSs or anything of the like, Results Hub does update as the rain does start to fall much heavier here at Lakeside Stadium. <laughs> 